chosen ones where you are where you are where you are chosen ones back with another powerful and productive video right great someone is crying and deeply regretting now yes for setting their eyes on you and you asking for exchange of contact details but they refuse to give it to you oh yes chosen one that is what this video is about you see this person cross paths with you and you meet their love list you meet their criteria of person that they want to be with in life and you know you try to get in touch with them requesting for exchange of contact but this person refuse meanwhile deep within them they love you but they want you to I mean, be a little persuasive, persuade them, chase them, you know, act some way as if, you know, you're putting in so much effort to get them so that they will feel validated. They will, they will feel, uh, they will be bruffing, like that kind of thing. But this is the case that the moment you try to, I mean, request for exchange of contacts and they said no, you say, okay rejection is protection so you know you bounce back and now they are thinking about it they are like no this is the person i've been desiring all along this is the person that meets my love list this person was so close to me yes i've seen this person face to face but there is but but what but i did not open up for them i did not open up i refuse to exchange contact with them and this could be so many reasons that you know this happened sometimes it is spiritual oh yes chosen one there are people that if good things are coming their way people that are going to really help them become their true and authentic self people that they are, you know, connected with to help them. The evil spirits in their family will go ahead of them and, um, I mean, make sure they, they, they play with, with their mind and other things and they are going to be a bit stubborn. This happens that they are you know unaware of it, it is this kind of subconscious kind of thing that happens to many people i'm telling you so many people they blow up opportunities that comes their way as a result of these evil spirits negative spirits that doesn't want good things good pe people in their family i'm telling you so that could be a reason why they refuse to exchange contact with you right the next reason is you know this person you meet their love list all right the person they want to be with you know the love they're searching for i mean you meet that but because they are shy because of shyness and low self-esteem they couldn't open up and exchange contact with you oh yes and many people have lost opportunities in this way. Opportunities have come to the way of so many people, many of us, but because of shyness and because of low self-esteem, we blew it up and we lost it. Oh yes, because we aren't confident in ourselves enough and we feel like this is the kind of person we want. But the person is so close to us and we, we're not feeling okay. We feel like, no, we're not worth it. We feel like we're not okay. We, we feel like, no, this person is too high for me. You know, you feel like that person is not, is, is, is not your level kind of person, right? You, you, you're looking down upon yourself. And as a result of that, even if they try to request for your contact, you're going to say no. And later... When you start to think, reflect on your life, on maybe what happens within the day, then you realize, hmm, 
you should have grabbed that opportunity but you blew it that's another reason because of shyness because of low self-esteem this make people to i mean kick out the, the their potential partners potential people that are supposed to be with them and build a family with them some people too because you know they want the person to be persuasive be chasing them you know have you realized that of late men are no longer persuasive oh yes just someone men are no longer persuasive if they try to get close to you and you've not opened up and you say no they wouldn't try to convince you they would not try to be chasing you you see chasing someone means the person is run out, running away so there is no need to be chasing the person each and every one values his or her time these days nobody wants to waste his or her time because time is money time is a very precious resource and if you are this type of person that you have this notion in your head that you must be pursued you must be persuaded you must be you know like some persuasion must follow before you open up or you 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 give up your contact details or something most of the time you are going to lose many opportunities because many opportunities and you know the people that are in your love list you're not gonna have them because the kind of person that you want that is honest that is faithful that is hard working that is making a significant amount of income you know that financial economic security that you want from your partner such people are busy people oh yes no hard-working man or person will come and you know be chasing you be wasting their precious time on you if you not open up your if you you are not open up in if you not open up yourself right they, they they will just leave they will just go away they will just i mean leave i'm telling you they will go they will go and most of the time they these people that are going to persuade you right many of such people they're not hard working oh yes i tell you the people that are really hard working and doing something that is purposeful busy with their life trying to build some kind of legacy some kind of empire some kind of great thing in life they're never gonna chase they're never gonna be persuading you they're not gonna be persuasive i'm telling you so know what you want and know that if you want a hard-working man no hard-working man will waste like 30 minutes an hour on you just trying to convince you no people that are confident and know what they can offer in a relationship they don't persuade they are not persuasive have you noticed that i'm telling you the people that are hard working that are cia people i mean what i mean by cia is confident intelligent and acceptive oh yes these people they will not persuade you you say no they're okay they go now you'll be left with yourself regretting and crying later for the opportunities you're supposed to grab and you blew it up oh yes just someone it is happening this is 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 on the ground happening right now i'm telling you you know a friend of mine a lady friend of mine shared um her experience with me about a day ago <laughs> All right. Maybe if the person is watching this video, the person might think, oh, <laughs> I derived their content from, you know, her experience. You know, this person, you know, uh, she said she has a love list of a kind of guy she wants. And, you know, fortunately, she took a car and the car she took, 
this same guy he has been dreaming about entered the same car the car the guy was looking good smelling good looking all right very fit i mean the kind of guy he, she wants and the guy sat close to her look at it again so as the car was going the guy was the guy asked of her name and the guy was trying to i mean asking requesting for exchange of contact details and this lady said no ah so he said as she said no the guy didn't talk any anymore the guy was just okay was normal you know fumbling playing with his phone and doing whatever he got to do on his phone so she said as you know um the guy alighted she also got to where she she was going you know later in the day she was reflecting and as she was reflecting she was like how did this happen this is the guy i want this is the kind of man i've always been waiting for and the opportunity was so close to me and i blew it up yes and i asked her so what could be her reasons for doing that and she was like oh uh, like she wanted him to i mean be persuasive persuade her i mean try to convince her talk more and stuff but you know the guy did none of such things i say you see just contact details you see sometimes we blew up opportunities like that people cross path with us they want just our contact details to be exchanged because they are meant to be our helpers but because of maybe shyness low self esteem or whatever reason or because you want validation you're going to blow up such opportunities i'm telling sometimes we want to manifest our dream partner this partner will be so close to us showing us all the green light but we don't have the confidence the the the, the self esteem to i mean manifest that person we want and we we when that happen you're going to blow it you're going to you're going to blow it because the person is is is, is just going to go away and later you'll be regretted and sometimes god being so good this opportunity can repeat itself with same person but still you keep on blowing it chosen one let me chip in this if it is shyness low self esteem work on yourself you know what your problem is hit the gym build the right shape right you know yourself if there is something that you need to work on work on it seek medical attention if there are certain things you need to work on to make you look more confident about yourself do it because shyness low self esteem makes us lose so many opportunities and we 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 blew so many chances away so work on yourself that is why it is good to hit the gym it is good to build your knowledge it is good to have the right for mindset it is good to be doing something that is purposeful it is good to be working on yourself because it helps you it shapes you it 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 gives you the emotional strength the physical strength the mental strength and makes you feel good about yourself and you will not be looking down upon yourself all right so it is very important for every chosen one to i mean do that work on yourself you know it best put in the work and learn from your mistakes right learn from your mistakes because sometimes who knows the way and manner god manifests himself in our lives always differs you don't know when you're going to meet your dream partner or something and if care is not taken you're going to miss that opportunity all right that's it the research saying that opportunity always come at once yes sometimes it comes more than once sometimes too it comes just once so when you grab it then you grab it oh yes chosen one 
there was another story of you know a lady and this lady loved the man and the man was doing everything to get in touch with the lady but the lady was trying to i mean make the man persuade like chase so later the man fall for i mean the the friend of a lady and now as i'm telling you they are happily married with two kids oh yes you see so opportunities always keep coming our way let's prepare ourselves to manifest what we want right that's it you need to prepare your vessel in order to have what you want that's all you need to do if not you're gonna regret you're gonna cry later when that chance is gone right great thank you chosen ones thank you for watching see you in my next video i'm out for now peace